I'm showing you how to use Worst Client for 1.20.5. To download Worst, you want to head over to their official website, worstclient.net, which is going to be linked down in the description, together actually with my Discord server, and I'd greatly appreciate it if you could join that. Now, really quickly before we continue, do you... Really quickly before we continue, you do actually need Fabric for 1.20.5 to be able to use Worst Client. If you don't have it or you don't know where to get it, then I will link it down in the description below. Anyways, continuing, the link to the Worst Client website in the description will link directly to this page, where if you scroll down a little, you'll find the download for Minecraft 1.20.5. You want to click on this black button, and that's going to download Worst Client for 1.20.5, and you also, very importantly, need to click on this white button to download the Fabric API. Now as you can see in my downloads, I have the Fabric API as well as Worst Client. So, what I can do now is press on Windows and R at the same time, and then right there type a percentage sign, app data, and then another percentage sign, just like so. Then you can hit on Enter or click OK, and you should end up in this folder right over here. Or actually, in this one. Either way, you want to make sure that you're in the folder called Roaming. Then, go into the .minecraft folder. You might need to scroll down a little until you find the Mods folder. This is the folder that you want to drag both the Fabric API as well as the Worst Client files right into, just like so. And once you've done that, you can close up both of these and open up the Minecraft launcher. This new loading screen is really cool, by the way. Anyways, in here, make sure you do have Fabric Loader for 1.20.5 selected, and we can play. We've loaded up 1.20.5 with Worst Client. Also, I would like to say, if you enjoy content like this, then consider subscribing, because I do make a lot more of it. Anyways, here inside of Minecraft, which, as you can see, we are right now, you'll immediately notice in the top left-hand side, the Worst Client logo. If you see that there, it's great, and it means that the client has been successfully activated. Anyways, I'm now going to be briefly showing you guys how to use it. I do actually have a complete in-depth tutorial telling you everything you need to know linked down in the description. I'm right now just going to be explaining how you can basically get started. Anyways, you can press on right shift and that is going to open up this menu over here. This menu basically contains all the utilities that West Client offers. As you can see, there is quite a lot. You can search for specific ones up here, and you can simply click on these to enable them, and click on them to disable them once again. If you hover above them, as you can see, you'll get a brief description. Now you'll also notice these green arrows. If you click on the arrow just like so, then you will get a little bit of a larger menu for this specific utility. In this case, AirPlace. It tells you the type what it does, as well as gives you some optional settings. And probably most importantly, it allows, it gives you basically a section where you can set a keybind for this. The keybind is, um, well, this client allows you to set a keybind for basically all of these. There we go, I finally found one that has a little more customization so I can show you. Basically, as you can see, the Mob ESP has a bunch of custom settings as well. Anyways, you can also, of course, enable it and disable it through there. All of these up here are sorted by alphabet. You can see when we scroll down all the way to the bottom here, the alphabetical sorting starts again, and these are other kind of types of utilities. For example, we have the worst logo over here, which is currently right there. If we can click on this, and then we can actually um, disable it, just like so. If you do, of course, wish to do that, we have the zoom functionality over here, which also allows you to set a keybind for the zoom. Um, there is the tab GUI, which I can enable right now. Um, there we are. And it basically allows you to, from out of this menu, access the GUI, which is this stuff, but then with the arrow keys, as you can see. Um, anyways, Basically, that is that. You can enable that if you do wish to do so. Some people prefer it. Some people don't. Honestly, I don't really use it. And finally, if you do want to disable Worst, you can, of course, just remove the mods, or you can do that through this part right here. 
Anyways, in the pause menu, you also see that we have a special button, which are the worst client options. Basically, it has the managers for your keybinds, x-ray and zoom, as well as some other general things, as well as settings. Anyways, finally, you can actually, um, there, this client has some commands. You might have seen them earlier since they are all listed here with a dot. Anyways, um, just like in Minecraft, you have slash give. For example, the slash is the prefix for worst client, the dot is the prefix. So I can type in dot help right here. And as you can see, I'll get a list of some of the commands, not all of them. There's a total of 51. You can list specific pages or once again, you can just right shift and they are all listed here with the prefix of a dot. Now, let's say you don't know what something does. I'll take the dot bind um, command as an example, right? So I can type in chat dot bind just like so. Anyways, here, as you can see, it basically tells you exactly how to use it and what it does. The syntax is right over here. If you don't want to view it through there, you can, of course, once again, also open this up and then simply view it by, by clicking on that. Anyways, um, that was basically that. Remember, the in-depth tutorial is down in the description. And oh yeah, there's actually one more thing. You see, a bunch of people in the last video was saying that I was calling worst client the worst client, aber das ist nicht so. You see, the worst client is simply fantastic. Es ist ein sehr guter client und um, I don't know exactly why people were saying that I was calling the worst client the worst client. Because that is just nicht so. Also, thank you ever so much for watching and I do of course hope to see you again in the next one. Bye bye.